to show you how to make these cubes. I, I love these, by the way. Um, I also made them into um, like a photo cube. You can kind of see here. So I'm going to show you how to do these today. Um, and this is all, you guys, this is all from my die cuts. So, yeah. So kind of just showing like the die cuts. So one of the things that I love about die cuts is on these particular ones, because we know a lot of people love these for planning and for just, in general, I feel like they people like these because they like to um, put them in their planners, in their crafting, and they're not actually stickers on the back. So we'll talk about that. I want you to know that this is powerful, that I am, and I hope for you today, I was inspired. Wow, I don't want to do this. What is wrong with me today? Um, I decided to do this really amazing cube and I'm going to show you how to make it um, because it's full of empowerment and this is going to stay on my desk and in fact I'm going to make more of these because I, I think it's so important. Step into action. Determined. Live your best life. Stop dreaming. Start doing. Find your tribe and love them. Your, the time to start is now. Choose daily to be happy. It's one step of a at a time. Make a difference. I am the CEO. Be authentic. Everything is energy. And so if you look at this cube here, like start now, you can see that I just took one package. I used an entire package of my die cuts. I actually used to create this. I did the Be Bold. It's empty here. You can see. But I even will cut these out, you guys. And, you know, I, did, so every, there's six sides to this. And so I just wanted to show you kind of how to do, how to do that. But also, I wanted to show that you could do these cubes. Oh, and um, I'm going to link this, the cubes, um, for you, an Amazon link to the exact ones. Because there's different ones, and these I um, love because they're really sturdy. And um, I will show you how they come apart. It's kind of cool to show you how I did this photo cube, so I'm going to go over that with you. So, um, on the back side of this, my art print that I did, it says, love yourself. And so, hopefully, if there's one thing that I hope you get from today, because crafting is craft. Crafts. A piece of paper is a piece of paper. Um... And what I want to share with you today that I hope that you will take with you, that you will write in your planner, that you will remember, you know, that I am. And um, that you will, you know, look at the products and the things that you're doing in your life. And are they building yourself, you know? Um, for example, you are deserving of your success. Um, and... I, I firmly believe in that, and we rise by lifting others, be all in, like, I just, hopefully, hopefully that makes sense, um, and I really love it, and, you know, don't think small, like, so every single side, there's six sides here, what do you think of that, babe? It's way cool. Who doesn't want, this would be the perfect Christmas gifts, by the way, you know, sure. it really would be. I feel like it holds candy too, but I'm probably wrong. No, it would. I actually thought about doing all kinds of make it a sparkle ball inside. It's like cool the interior decorator in me was like, you could put anything in there. You could actually do. And so how this works, you guys. Oh, I'll show you. So this is how it works. It comes apart. They come together. You could put something in there and give somebody a gift, by the way. How cool is that? Um, I always say if you are doing gift giving, Give a gift that matters. What I used to create this, it took one whole package. It is the Be Bold die cut set. Um, I grabbed these and I was going to use these, but they're sold out. They're yeah, sold out. Both of them are gone. I'm sad. Um, if you want die cuts, if you like how I do the die cuts, please say yes, die cut. And so all the die cuts, these are the new ones. These are bright side. There's like so I want you to think about that. So you could do a gratitude one. You can do all of these die cuts. Like, oh, I love these. So what I thought I would do is I'm going to show you how to recreate that. Now, if you see this cute 
one of Ezra. Oh my gosh, you guys. Like, I'm going to cry every time I see his sweet little face. One of the things that my grandbabies love about me, that my kids have told me, um, not Ezra because he doesn't speak yet, but they love that I do projects and things with their photos and it makes them feel special. I still remember when Beckett was here on my wife that one day. Yeah. He's like, this whole book is about me. This is about me. And so imagine, you know, and McKay, maybe I'll give it to you, but I don't know if I can. But how cute is this to have this in his room? And they know that they're significant, right? Okay, so let me show you how this one works. So, as I, I'm like, take it apart. Okay, this is so sturdy. No, it's it's way, it's not hard at all. It just comes apart. But it's not so flimsy, you know. Mm -hmm. So it comes apart. So you guys, you're going to go, okay. Well, how did Teresa do this? So I am going to give you the link. So there are six photos. My, um, these, um, I just cut it to the size of the cubes. This happens to be three and a quarter by three and a quarter. You could um, do whatever. Their cubes come in different sizes. I found this is like the perfect size and so in really good quality because sometimes you get these cubes and they, they're kind of hazy and I like the really clear clip. So how you're gonna do that if you want to do a photo, we're gonna start the class um, or I should say, I'm going to show you how to do it. So you will take these and most of these come with an inside. This is a hollow, clear, not clear, but it's a box, right? So if you want to do photos, you guys, very, very simply, photo cubes are so easy to do. What you're going to do is you're going to take a photo, you're going to take it, and here's the thing, you're going to cover up. So that's how I did my last. It's so simple, you guys. Just put a little tape on it. And because you're not, it's not going to fall out. So you just put a little tape on it. You don't have to, I just had this literally some red line that I just had on my, um, on my desk because, whoa, it wants to really stick. It's like, can you come? Oh, there we go. So you don't need this, by the way. I just grabbed it because it was super fast. And then I'm going to take it and I'm going to put it on this cube. And let's just pretend I had already added all of those, you guys. Look at this. So simple. I would just add that there. And then I would take my bottom. And that is how simple if you want to add a photo. Now, I'm going to show you how to do the other. You ready? So this is bright side. And so these are all the die cuts. Let's see. This one has 70 plus pieces in here. We did change our packaging. I don't know. Sometimes I'll be honest. Like, I kind of like... It's... Look at the difference. Which packaging do you like? Do you like the first one or the second? Put number one or two, which packaging you prefer. Now, I probably think you're going to like this because it, but on this one, you can kind of see more of what it looks like. I would love to know your opinion on die cut packaging one or die cut packaging two. Let me know. Now, you're going to go, okay, how in the world, what did you do? to because you were going to do all six of these okay so here is what i did are you ready okay you are going to want your teresa collins sticker maker and by the way i'm pretty sure these are on our website again we finally got our order in thank goodness and if they're not it will be it should be so normally you would do what you want you're going to do face up now, the reason why you're going to do face up, you guys, is because you want the sticker on the back. But on this situation, I want my words to have the stickers actually on the front. So, let's get busy. You're going to do face down because we want the adhesive. You can see that going through. Okay, there we go. And then, okay, so. A little, it coming? It's, it's coming. It's doing good. So, these little individual words are sticker maker. amazing. So I'm just taking the die cuts, if you're wondering what I'm doing, and I'm putting it down because I actually want the sticker on the front. And you're going to be like, why does she want it on the front? But you'll see. And I'm just doing a few of these. So if you've never used the sticker maker, so whatever you put face down, the sticker goes on there. So I'm just pulling this through. Um, and I love, love, love these. I love this. Oh, I love the word happy. I love the word happy. In fact, I'm going to trim it down just a little bit. It's a little bit bigger on the cube than I want, which is totally fine. So I'm just going to trim that just a little. So that's the cool thing that anything you put in here, this the size, you can just take it, do face down. You're going to 
pull it through. Um, there's so many fun things. Oh, the heart. Check the heart on there. Okay, we'll do that. Here. Why would anything? It so it's gonna make a sticker out of anything that you put through here. Okay. I love this one. This one says, turn lessons into blessings. We'll put that one. Remember all that you have. So we'll do that as well. Okay, and then, you know what? I love these words like gratitude mindset, um, the red. I think it's going to be really pretty. Because what you're going to go for is you're going to kind of like create a collage, if that makes sense. What do you think of that, Brian? Does that I'm, make sense? I'm excited for it. Are you Are you sure? Are you sure? I'm legit excited. My for husband it. is so funny. He he's just being so sweet to me today, and I love him. So I'm even gonna do this long one here just to show you. Because guess what, you guys? There's no wrong way or right way in the things that you're creating. So let me show you this. For example, I did mine very randomly. So this was the complete package of the Be Bold, and that is this comes with 87 pieces. And so I am also that frugal girl. I will take the back of my packaging and cut those out. I didn't on this one, but believe me, I have. And so you can see um, how I did this. So let me show you how you adhere it to your cube. Now this is gonna be, again, this is complete up to you personal preference. Now what you wanna do is once you have taken out your Teresa Collins Zyron Maker, what you're gonna do is I like to just, it tells you to rub and peel, but you know, I just kind of do that. So this is, I'm just pulling this all back. Oops, I missed that on that side. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I, I definitely don't want to sing sing because I think a lot of you are gonna be very disappointed if I start singing. Okay. <laughs> Brian, don't say anything. Well, I think you, you know, all what? Kind okay. know the deal with your I'm really good at certain ability. things and I know oh, I you're can, very good I at can a lot decorate, of things. I can singing Okay, so one. now you guys notice with going through the sticker maker, my adhesive's on the, the front side. Now why did I use the Teresa Collins sticker maker? Because you, the adhesive is amazing and it will stick, but the, you're not going to be able to see it once you put it on your cube. So I go in and I go from the back side. Okay, here's the deal because I want it to be protected. So I just go in from the back side of my cube. I, you can't even see, you guys. Look at that. I wish you could see my mind being blown right now. Is your now. mind being blown right now? So well, then. I was, I was okay. wondering why it was going backwards. Okay, now. I see. Well, okay. The word happy, so I like this. So I tend to go, and I just, I like a little bit of space, and you just wanna kinda make it as even as you can, and um, doing this, okay, there. And then I got the H. Like, how cute is this? So you're giving somebody a happy cube. You're giving them a, I'll give you know, a 10. And you could put, you could still put their, their, you know, oh, here's a heart. This is the gold foil heart. And I'm literally going to, you know what? It needs to be right there. It needs to be right there. I feel like you could mix and match, right? You could go mix some and photos match. And some you could do digits. photos. You could do all words. And here's the thing: the adhesive. I just press it down, and you really don't see it. So I'm going to keep building this. And you guys, I it's so random for me. Like this one says, "Give thanks." Oh my gosh, I love that because I think that's so important. So I just go. From the inside, it's actually really easy to do. This one says, give thanks. Like, how cute is this, you guys? And you could. Like, you could make some of them, like, you could make a love one. This one says, appreciate everything. And I'm going to put this on the bottom. And here's the deal. Isn't this amazing, you guys? Like, they're probably like, Tracy, you're kind of crazy. But I really want to show how I do it. And hopefully, um, it's not overwhelming. Now, this one that says, Love, 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 love. Keep this in mind because I'm going to be using that, but not yet. So this one is really cool. This one says gratitude mindset. So then I can kind of see, oh, that's a little bit too long to go where I want it to go. So I'm going to go and know that on the top here, I want to do it along the top so that when you see uh, the top of your cube, just kidding. you didn't get me. So this is the top. One. So, if that makes sense. So, I'm still going to work on this. And I just, this one says, remember all that we have. Okay, this is a really cool one. This could be really, because you could do words, well, not even words. You know what you could do, Brian, that I think is really cool? Put you candy could, in it. Well, yeah, you could do candy. But, no, what you could really do 
is you can do, um, you could still do photos, and I can just add more in here. And then you fill it up as much as you want. Like this one says priority, um, and I'm going to put that one. Sorry, you guys, I have to kind of just kind of look to see. So this is kind of how you're going to do it. You're going to go here, and I take my, my piece here, and then I just go in and I go, what could fit? Oh, that doesn't quite fit. Or, but also, I love how this can, it kind of just goes a little bit behind the heart, and I love that, okay? And then, I'm going to take my scissors, and so it's kind of like you're, it's like a puzzle, and you're going to decide, like, you know, this one says memories, and I want to put memories down here, so I got that, okay? Now, I know that I love the word love. And so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take this and I just cut it, you guys. So there's, remember, there's no rules in your, in your creativity. So I'm just going to cut that down. And so that's what's really cool about it is you can take your die cut ephemera pieces. Look how cute this is, Brian. Some other things that you could do. A lot of you get my empowerment box. You guys, you could cut these out. You could cut these out and put these in here. The same thing. So you can just run it through your sticker maker. You can, you know, decide what you want to put on here. What I want to share is I want to share my stickers. So this is one of my sticker sheets. Um, this one is the gift thanks, and I love this one. It comes white and black, and you can tell I use it a lot. So you're gonna say, well, Teresa, if you use this as a sticker, that means you would have to put it on the outside of your cube. No, no, no. You can use my stickers, too, because you want it to be protected. See, this is protected, right? So, this is how you would do it. So, you're, you're going, hmm, what is she going to do? So, I'm going to take this, and I'm going to cut it. And, so, instead of, don't take the backing off, you guys. Don't take your backing off. And, again, you're going to take it, and you're going to put it face down, and I really love these. I got, I gotta, you know, I gotta show the hearts here. So all of these things that you know you want to add, you're just gonna cut it out from your sticker sheets. And I know some of you are like, oh, no, but they're stickers. You're gonna, you're gonna be blown away. So this works with anything. Oh no, it doesn't work with anything. Only the Teresa Collins stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just kidding. Of just course. kidding. Just kidding. I'm in a really good mood today. I really am. I'm just grateful. I'm very thankful. Sorry. It's good, sister. It really is. Okay, so you guys, so I put the sticker in, and yes, so we're going to take it and we're going to pull it down. Okay, I'm addicted. Like, if I didn't have this sticker maker, you guys, <gasps> what would I do? Okay, it makes, well, it just makes it a lot easier. Okay, so I'm pulling this off. Now you're like, what in the world, Teresa? Well, it was already a sticker. So watch this. <gasps> I took the sticker off now. And you're like, but what? Because it's going to make it easier to see, trust me. So I took the sticker backing off now. Didn't do it before. Now I'm going to go in and I'm going to go, okay, so this is a sticker. So guess what, you guys? The sticker now is on the front. Okay, so I'm going to take it. And with my fingers, now it sticks. Now you're going to go, but it's going to be sticky on the other side. I could do, I like to use my finger, you can use, if it bothers you that it's sticky, no one's really going to know, nothing's going to really stick to it, but what I would recommend is you could take some um, baby powder and just put it on your finger after you're done, and there you go, that is how you do a sticker as if it was a die cut, okay, so I'm going to do it again, so to show you, so I, I'm addicted to hearts, you guys, I have this thing for hearts, I'm addicted to hearts, I'm addicted to stars, I'm addicted to all this fun stuff. So what I'm gonna do, oh, I need a heart right here beside the thankful gratitude. So I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna put it, I'm gonna visually, I come from behind the cube. <gasps> Look how cute that is! And if you don't think it's cute, just don't let me know, it's okay. I'm gonna be honest with you. You don't like it. I think it's pretty cute. I think it's cute, like, and I love using the supplies and and why not? Like I'm, I've got so many empowerment stickers and die cuts and you know, the, the thing I today when well, I... You could just go through a giant sticker stash. And just yeah, you totally could. No you know what really 
is sad when I realize that some of our stuff is sold out and our die cuts are getting very low. And so that should be it. Brian loves that problem. He's like, yeah. You know, and I'm like, no, I love them. So here's the another. This one says count your blessings. So again, it's sticky on the front. And I'm just going to take it and I'm going to put it right there beside that. And then we've got some more. We've got the... The, you know what? I really like the love, love, love. So why not take the love, 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 you guys? And I'm going to put this along the bottom here. Okay, oops. I didn't get it quite. There we go. Um, and then I even have a little bit. So there you go. I mean, and, and then I'll have some more room. But so hopefully, does that make sense? And then you've created or we're creating a fun cube. Like how cute is that? So I hope you like it. That is how I did this empowerment one. Um, again, this was just one photo cube and this was um, one set of my die cut pieces. But again, oh God, well now, I was a little aggressive on that one. So this is one cube and here is another cube with cute little Ezra and his little bow tie. There you go. So, um, Hopefully that makes sense. I hope you enjoyed this. I will post the link um, to the die cuts, the box, if you're interested. And if you haven't and you want to join um, me for my first live virtual event ever, I would love to have you. I would be honored to have you. Um, and use the code Teresa10 and save $10 off. So, bye guys.